Alrighty. I realized after some adjustments that the last essentially 30 minutes of the playthrough had no audio to it, but I guess it's a, it's, it's a learning process. We're going to go and rejoin our friend in the world of Skyrim now. Um, as you may or may not have heard, well, I guess you didn't hear because there's no, I said no goddamn no audio. Teachers, no and these two are gonna, no these two are gonna frickin' well, bitch and moan at each other. Let's hear it. We are done this is a Skyrim redone this. playthrough. Oh. <clears throat> a customer. Skyrim redone is a overhaul mod. Um, there's a bunch of other mods. Probably, I think, if I last time I counted, there are 250 mods. There are no graphical other than the Maybe high definition texture pick. I have a texture pack uh, that edit how anything looks in the game. There are a few quest mods, there's a few additional land mods. Well, I don't know what. But, uh, the Riverwood go Trader is still open. Uh, the yeah. Riverwood Trader is everything you need in a general store. Uh, did yeah, something happen? We, we did have a bit of a, a break in. But we, we still have plenty to sell. Robbers were only after one thing. An ornament. Solid gold in the shape of a dragon's claw. Yet again, the dragonborn. The most meddlesome per person in all of Skyrim. You could? I've got some coin coming in from my last shipment. It's yours if you bring my claw back. Now, if you're going to get those thieves, you should head to Bleak Falls Barrow, so northwest plan, of maybe? town. Yes. So now you don't have to go, do you? Well, I think your new helper here needs a guide. Uh, no, I... This is from the Midas I Magic mod, if I remember correctly. But only to the edge of town. So I'm playing with the race menu. That's why I'm a good bit taller than everyone else. I'm playing on Legendary. I have... I will be uploading the non-narrated part of this. Oh, uh, this climber to Tamriel. Where'd she go? Oh, this thing. This is probably one of the buggiest walks in we all of Skyrim. Town and across the bridge to get to Bleak Falls Barrow. You can see it from here, though. The mountain just over the buildings. I don't see it. Those thieves must be mad hiding out there. Those old crypts are filled with nothing but traps, trolls, and who knows what else. I wonder why they only stole Lucan's Golden Claw. I mean, we have plenty of things in the shop that are worth just as much coin. Lucan found the claw about a year after he opened the store. He never quite explained where he got it. He's a tricky one. As I said, this is one of the buggiest walks in the entire game. Uh, let's go. Move. How come when I wasn't recording and I was just fiddling around with this, you, you walked fine? Okay, we're just going to run along here. So a couple hints that you probably saw, uh, of course, now, as soon as I start talking... Okay, say your piece and we'll... This is the bridge out of town. The path up the mountain to the northwest leads to Bleak Falls Barrow. I guess I should get back to my brother. He'll throw a fit if I take too long. <laughs> Mara bless you for agreeing to help us. How much further? Well, it's a winding road up the mountain just ahead. You'll know you're in the right place once you spot... Once you get to the tower, head north. Bleak Falls Barrow should be just around the corner further up. Good luck. Lucan and I will be waiting. Holy crap. Okay. Um, so a couple things that I covered when I didn't know that it wasn't picking up the audio. It's still new to the... to setting up Shadowplay to record my voice along with everything else. Uh, when you look at the playthrough, I went in with the 
Uh, Stormcloak guy, the only reason I did that is because if you plan on going heavy armor, the only way you get heavy armor during the introductory part of the game is going in with the Stormcloak guy. You beat the Imperial officer to death and she has a set of heavy armor on her. Uh, one with the Nord, just because I'm used to playing them. There, I'm playing on Legendary. I'll use the You just suck, you're gonna die a lot. I am gonna die a lot. It's horribly difficult already in Skyrim Redone. Uh, as in a wolf can kill me right now. Uh, for those of you who don't know about Skyrim Redone, it rebalances everything inside the game to include the perk trees, as you can see. The perk trees are completely different. We'll be going through them throughout the uh, throughout the entire playthrough. A little note on to what Wayfarer is, because you're going to see it um, a lot. Uh, Wayfarer is just something that essentially your survivalist perk tree. It's meant to build uh, to build things within uh, both Frostfall. It interacts with both Frostfall and realistic needs and diseases, which um, I need to turn on actually. Now that I think about it, to our handy dandy. Go ahead and turn on both of these. Basic needs. Please exit menu. There we are. Okay. Now we're going to turn on, quote unquote, Frostfall. Austin Fault thought you reflect back on how much the wilds have taught you about yourself over the last several days. You recall a book you once had, you once lost, that was full of wisdom about survival in the open country. On a whim, you open your pack, a pack, and find a survivor's guide to Skyrim staring back up at you. Had it always been there, or had thought alone summoned it? You push aside the thought as you thumb through its pages and then carefully place it back, knowing that some things are never truly lost. Oh, God. Jesus H. Christ. Oh, I'm going to die. <laughs> yeah, there's my death. Um, so though you haven't played Scar Oh my god. I have to listen to you again. I do not believe in quick saving, so there may be a lot of this. Okay, we're just not going to freaking... I'm not even going to wait for her. She's probably going to talk to herself. Oh, look, over there, it's the mountain. Past the giant fucking Aurora Borealis. Must be mad hiding out there. Hey! Watch it. Oh my god. I wonder why they only stole Lucan's golden claw. I mean, we have plenty of things in the shop that are worth just as much coin. Oh, uh, yes, I have spend dragon souls for perk points. This is the bridge out of town. The path up the mountain to the northwest leads to Bleak Falls Barrow. I guess I should get back to my brother. He'll throw a fit if I take too long. <laughs> Such a child. Okay, now we're just going to... My configuration menu, check in realistic needs and diseases, basic needs. Start realistic needs and diseases! There we are. Supposedly now I can go into the Frostfall. There it is. Overview. Frostfall is enabled. Presets classic. Where? What does where do? I can't change any of that.
I'm now prepared to... So I'm supposed to read that, I think. Essentially, this is just telling us that Cold is indeed the enemy. You go read your goddamn survival's guide, and now you can start to freeze to death. So, we're going to... So anyway, that little bar up there tells me whether or not it's cold, warm, if I'm inside, does it really fucking matter? See me ask, what are you doing, pussy? So yes, in case you're wondering, a wolf can kick my ass right now. Um, I think... The, the trick with all Elder Scrolls games is the following. At a certain point, you do become an invincible murder hobo. Uh, until that point, which becomes later and later, the more you, even with the, with, with the redone respect things and i make sure I don't... I know there's another wolf somewhere. Oh god. I need to conserve my stamina. Stamina... Heavy armor really affects you. In this... Oh jeez. No way. Nobody likes you. key is there's a certain point you have to work up to being a murder hobo Imperial business. right head. right I'm not believe me yeah bug the guy in the freaking Imperial outfit the storm cloak dude hanging out in the back of that freaking village back there So I figure we'll probably earn a bit of coin, and we'll probably do a couple quests in uh, Whiterun before we continue on with the main quest. Oh! Oh my goodness! It's a giant! He is on fire! Oh, jeez! Oh, why me? 